<clears throat> Where are you? What's good to know your family? Welcome back to another <clears throat> Mukbang guys, uh, so let's go. Let's start the intro. Let's go Sorry guys, uh, the food's taking over my um, my channel, so thank you for coming. Oh, look at that, yes. Thank you very much for watching our video here. Yeah, I'm gonna try and um, get around this, but thank you very much for coming. For those who are new, please don't forget to press the subscribe button down the bottom there, guys. Also press the notification bell so you're notified every single time that we post up a video, which has been every second day lately. But if you're returning OG man, thank you very much for coming and always commenting and enjoying our video. All right, today, as you can see, we are finally doing the Massive donut from Costco, guys, and we've added the rocky road to it. Look at that, yummo, guys. Let's do a little ASMR. Yummo. So let's leave those two in the front there. Uh, yeah, about there. Let's have a look at this donut. This donut is legit. Two kilos. Ooh. As you know, us Tinanyu family, we love donuts and we don't even like to share it. So, today I'm gonna eat it all by myself. Alright, let's get it, let's get it. Got my juice over here. So, Brenda and I went to Costco's a few days ago. If you haven't seen that vlog, go and have a look at that one. It's the first time that Costco's been here in Perth. When I saw it, I was like a little kid, man. Look at it. It literally looks like a donut. And it feels like a donut. It's not like a cake pastry, so. Looks really yummy, people. It's got the M&M's on top. Yeah, it's M&M's, look. M&M's, some sprinkles, and I believe that it is strawberry filled. Let's get all freaking excited, man. Should I bite it or cut it? I don't know if I should bite it or cut it. I want to bite it, actually. Let's bite it. Let's bite it first. All right. Let's get this. Uh. Oh, it's like a real donut. Mmm, man, that is exactly the dough of a donut. Uh, while I'm eating this, go grab you something to eat and come back and let's have a chat, man. Don't forget, subscribe down the bottom. Oh, mmm. Very doughy. I haven't come across the jelly bit yet inside. They said there's a jelly bit, but <laughs> man, I'm loving it. Absolutely loving it. Mm. Yeah. I got this about three days ago, so I looked at the expiry date. I was like, oh my gosh, today's the last day, I better eat it. I feel like I need to cut it so you guys can see the inside of it. Let's have a look. Let's have a looky looky at it. I want to have a look at it. I didn't even know what's inside it. Okay, ready? Ready? Let's go! There's nothing in there. It's literally a donut. I thought it was jam. It was meant to be jam filled or something. No, of course, it's a donut. It's all donut. Mmm. Yummy. So, I have this half, and you have that half. Okay? Yeah, man. Mmm. Yummy. Got my juice here, guys. 
I'm glad it's not jam filled because it says strawberry trifle jumbo donut. That's what it is. Maybe they meant this thing here. So strawberry trifle jumbo donut. Oh, I like it anyway. I like it anyway. Legit. Mmm. I live for donuts. Absolutely love donuts. My favorite donut would be a simple cinnamon donut. That's what I love. I've tried um, Krispy Kremes and that. I only can have probably about two or three of those. Like, sorry, I could have 12 of those. <laughs> but I always love just the simple cinnamon donuts. Don't mind the icing every now and then. Like today. I haven't had breakfast yet, guys. Mmm. Um, and then we got Rocky Road. Just to add to the muff bun, guys. Mmm, I mean. I'll tell you a story when I was younger. I was actually living with my godparents in Hurstville, so I went to Hurstville Boys. Shout out to Hurstville Boys, anyone from Hurstville? I used to catch a bus to the train, Hurstville's train station because we lived in Pentas. And then walk to school. But I loved the walk because my mum always gave me extra money. I just at my bus depot. The first shop that I had to go through, because I had to go through her for uh, Westfields. The first shop that I had to go through on the left, and my bus stop was right there, was Donut King. Mm -hmm. Every morning I got something different. And sometimes my friends are like, do you want to meet up? I said, nah, I'm all good bro, my mum's going to drop me off. <laughs> but really, I bought like a data every single day and, it, and coming back. Mmm. Love it. It's actually really yummy, hey. With all the pink icing on it. So that must be the the trifle, tri strawberry trifle on top. I don't know why I call it trifle. Mmm. low percent, hundred percent, guys. <laughs> Sorry. Got a gallon of juice, guys. Couldn't find any milk in the house. Let's have some of this. Oh, look at that. That's a freaking good rocky road, eh? Marshmallows. It's got peanuts inside it. Oh, look at that car. Biscuit. And then the chocolate. Yummy. I couldn't tell you where we got this one from because we got it from um, my sister-in-law. Which she got it from her brother. <laughs> oh. Yummy. Another um, story when I was a kid. We used to live at Shelby. My parents bought a house in Shelby. We moved from... All the way from Auburn to Shelby. And uh, mum used to give us $2. $2 back then, that's all we got for lunch. But you could afford that for lunch. So me and my brother, my twin brother, always used to save our money. We'll meet up at the shops. He had his friends and I had my friends. Then after school, 3 o'clock, we'll always wait for each other at the uh, takeaway store. His $2 will buy us a gallon. Two litres, sorry. Two litres of orange and mango juice. And I would save my $2 for hot chips. And then we'll walk home. Oh. It was a best. Legit. Can't remember if my brother had a sweet tooth. I did fully. Mm. In our household too. There were six of us kids. But us islanders as well. Help out. With people coming from overseas so... My parents arrived here in Australia 79, so it was people always coming in. But every time mum bought something, like uh, chocolate biscuits or something like that, 
it would be gone in two seconds. We were those six kids and then aunties and uncles and then a cousin came and lived with us. But man, when I moved out with Miss B's, I loved Tim Tams. Tim Tams was my favorite because it was rare in our house. <laughs> it was rare as fobs, man. Mm. So every time that when Brenner and I um, first moved into our uh, blocks of units in Mount Druitt, man, can he? We'd always walk down to Woolies, get us like Tim Tams, chocolate. She hasn't got much of a sweet tooth. I do. She used to love getting hot, uh, chips though. She loves crisps. Ah, quarter of the way through, guys. You still haven't had your half, man. Oh, sorry. Yeah. Have a bite. There you go. Mm. <laughs> Stole that off, Favids. <laughs> oh, look at that strawberry. Oh, it's not even breaking properly. Really, it tastes like a freaking donut. Mmm. Yummy. It's really yum. Mm. Let us know what you're doing. Down below, as always, we appreciate everyone's comments. And yes, we are reading your comments and Diamond will get back to you shortly. I'm dying. Every time I see a comment, I want to comment to it, but trying to get into routine this year with my kids helping out um, with YouTube and stuff like that. So, Sapphire does all the IG when she bloody feels like it. Diamond does uh, the commenting when she bloody feels like it. And um, myself, I do all the editing, so Miss B will jump on when she feels like it. Yummy. Right at this time in isolation, guys, is the best time mm, to support your locals if they're open in your country. There's Uber Eats here in Australia. I'm sure there is all over the world in America as well. You know, just support if you can. A pizza, ten dollar pizza, helps out that business stay afloat. Oh, let's do the rocky road, man. But I really want that pizza. Is that? I'm just gonna buy it. I love peanuts. Mmm. Mmm. Sucky, the sucky eyes, man. Mmm. Every part of that is filled with yummy goodness. Love Rocky Road. And then mixed in with the donut. Donut. Mm. Beautiful. I'm even full, man. I've always had my half. That's all I got left. Comment down below if you've had this from Costco's. They had about 50 stacked up and I'm like, holy hell. <sighs> I only woke up about two hours ago. When I got ready for my wife bung and ready to go to sleep again. <laughs> we are loving all the comments as we said before. Thank you for everyone for supporting our channel. Eh? It's been a journey and a half, eh? So like, we've been doing this for two years and we got hacked. Almost made it to 2K and, and in about a year and then we got hacked. Then people were unsubscribing because uh, they were sick of seeing uh, pimples on the on our channel. That's what they were doing. <laughs> mm. Then it took us two months to get our channel back. And another two months to get monetized again. And now we're still waiting for the rest of our back office to come on, well, our, our YouTube studio to come on. But, so many times I want to give up, but I'm the type of person that's like, gotta keep going, man, gotta keep going. We've come this far, 
there is light at the end of the tunnel. And when we see you guys commenting down below, makes us feel amazing. Really, it's one or two comments, man. We love it. Wow, you see that? <laughs> rocky road, rocky road. Mm hmm, mm hmm, mm hmm. Mm. I'm done. I've only had half of that rocky road. There's the other half of that rocky road. And you still got your half that you need to finish. Alright, turn out your family. You know when that cut comes in. <laughs> We're done. I'm done. I'm done. I'm all done. Man, that donut was legit beautiful. Hope you enjoyed this video. Thank you very much for watching. Don't forget to subscribe down the bottom. Okay? Three things we'd like you to do, and that is to like, subscribe this video to the world, and like, Come back tomorrow for the next video. Oh, keep watching our other videos, okay?